Okay, what is up everybody? So on behalf of Jared333's YouTube channel, I am going to be reviewing this um, Armatron watch and I'm going to show you how to uh, update it and basically change the time and how to understand it a little bit more. So this one is the red one because that's Jared's favorite color and the back is stainless, stainless steel. It also comes with adjustable straps, so you are able to change the size according to your preference or to your um, the the width of your um, your wrist, right? So let's get go ahead and get started. So here you have the reset button, you have mode, and then you have like the setup. And it also shows you different functions here, such as the date. So the date, the day of the week is already fine because today is Sunday. And um, let's get started with trying to change the time. Okay, so you're going to make sure that it's on the time of day. And you're going to basically keep your finger down on the reset button. So when you see it blinking that's when you're going to go ahead and make sure that you're going to change either the hour or the minute. So let's say the hour is good. If it's four in the afternoon or if it's four in the morning, you can go ahead and change the minutes. And then when, once you're ready to change it, you're going to come up here to set up and you're going to check the time, right? So let's go ahead and find out what our local time is here in Texas. It is 8.17. So that's 8 p.m. So first, I want to go ahead and change this to 8. Okay? It's as easy as that. So now you're on the hour. You want to go ahead and move to the minute. So click mode again. And here you are on the minutes. So again, now it's 8.17. I'm going to just keep pressing setup until it's 8.17, right? So you're good. All you're going to do now is go ahead and hit reset one more time, okay? There you go. So now you are good to go with your time. Go ahead and press that. And if you want, if you press mode again, it has a stopwatch. So you're gonna want to, if you want to time yourself with anything, you're gonna press the mode function because the mode function has all the different things, that uh, the, the settings that the arm, that the armatron watch has right so now it's timing us so if you're timing a race or if you need to you know make sure something's a specific time you can just hit the mode button once more and then start for the timer and then to stop it you can just hit the setup once again and then if you want to keep going to resume it you can hit it another time okay so i don't want to to time anything right now so what i'm going to do is hit the reset button so if you want to time something else, so let's say you need to time multiple things, you can go ahead and each time you get started, you can stop it and reset it. So it's good for races or if you're trying to see, you know, what's faster, what, what, which uh, thing, or if you're racing, if you have, you know, kids that are racing, this is the function you're going to want to use. Let's move on now to this function. So here you have military time. So it is already eight in the uh, in the evening so i don't want to change that and let's see this one this one is your the main function here so we can see if you want to change it again keep your finger pressed so let's say if it wasn't this is not the right one you can go ahead and hit the reset button and then the setup button is going to help you change all of that so i don't want to change that right because i'm good there i'm going to reset it once more reset it okay and then that's just a little bit of like a quick setup basically for your farmatron watch and how to quickly set it up for the time of day and um to get it to your local time right so of course if you're changing if you're traveling and you're going through different time zones again you can have your because it's not going to change automatically you're going to have to 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 set it up on your own so it's really quick you can just easily go to mode and then which function you're trying to change and then once you get to the specific function you're trying to change just hit reset and don't forget you're going to need to keep your finger pressed down 
in order to get that hour button moving along, okay? And then to change through uh, the either the hour or the minute, you're going to hit the mode button, okay? And this works, this is for if you are um, traveling within the United States, if you are going across, you know, somewhere else across the world and you just need to change the time, it's the same thing. Just make sure that you are keeping up with that because it's not going to do it automatically. You will have to manually make sure that you know what the time is in wherever you are and keep that updated. So here we go. I'm just going to, oh, I keep passing it. It's eight, so I want to go back to eight. Yep, and there we go. So for the military time, let me go back here. So I don't, when you, when you want to stop, if you're done resetting it, so you press it for, you keep your finger on it for a long time. Then what you want to do when you're done, hit it again one time. Okay. And then let's go back here. And this is counting the seconds and it's counting uh, the hour and the minutes. It's just the same way that other other watches would be doing that, right? It's the same thing. So it has different functions. And this one is not letting me change the minute for some reason. But that is basically how you're going to set up your Armatron watch. And they're all pretty much the same. They have the same functions. This one is waterproof. So it is going to, if you go swimming with it and you forget to take it off, not to worry. It is water resistant up to 330 feet. The casing, this part here, like basically um, the part that you wrap around your wrist is, uh, what is it? acrylic. So this is acrylic and this is stainless steel. And I do believe if you don't like the color you can easily change the straps. So all you need to do is get a tiny screwdriver, take it out and change it to some straps that you prefer. And that can be easily done. And if you like to keep it on like a different type of, um, if you don't like to wear it on your wrist, you can also change it. I've seen some people take the straps out completely and wear it as like a necklace or keep it as a keychain. Those are also other options you have because you don't have to keep the same wrist, the same um, wristband, right? So this part is the most important part because this is the part that obviously you're going to be using to time things, to set your alarm, or to to keep you know tabs about what time of day it is. So I per I personally like this style because it's big. If you want to see in the dark, so if it's nighttime and you want a light, you would press this button here. So basically I, I have the flash on so you're not gonna be able to see how it looks, but just trust me when I say that this button is for when you cannot see and you just need, it's nighttime. So you press this one and it's gonna let you see the time at night. So it does have quite a bit of good functions. I would personally rate this watch an eight out of 10. And that's because Jared's had this watch for several years and he's pretty hard on his uh, possessions, especially his electronics. He doesn't really take care of them. Um, he moves quite a bit and he doesn't pay attention to, you know, if he's going swimming, he's not the type of person who's like, oh wait, let me take it off. Let me, you know, do this. So luckily this watch is very, very durable. He's dropped it several times. I have personally seen him drop this watch several times and he always takes it wherever he goes. So that does speak wonders if you followed YouTube Jared's channel and you know what he's been through, you know what this watch has been through as well. So that does speak a lot about the quality of Armatron. And I do believe they have lifetime warranties, which is amazing because you can get them nowadays for just a few, like 20 bucks, 30 bucks, and you can get yourself a lifetime uh, for Armatron watch that is very, very durable, water resistant. And again, travel the world with it because it's going to come in handy when you are doing the, the different uh, time, you know, you have a delay or you have, you're going through different um, 
time zones, it's going to be really, really handy for you. So hopefully this video helped you understand the Armatron watch a little bit more. And if it did, go ahead and like this video, subscribe and share. Thank you so much for watching.